So this one, the a value, remember it's ax squared plus bx plus c, and of course we're setting it equal to zero because we're completing the square. But um, the a value here is negative one. Remember, if the a value is not positive one, then we have to GCF that out. And then the rest of the steps will follow. However, there's a little bit of a multiplication that you have to handle, and it's the signs. Okay, so look. This is a negative one. If I factor out the negative one, I get positive x squared minus three x. I'm gonna add my box. Now, this I'm not gonna mess with. I'm gonna have it jump over. It's positive five, and here I go, okay? She's so tempted, is that what? Just uh, nice. Are you still recording? Yes. Okay, so, so far so good? So look, by taking out a negative one, now for some of you, if, it, if it's easier for you to think of it this way, it's as if you're, you're dividing by a negative one, if that helps you, but I'm taking the negative five and I'm removing it before I factor out that negative one GCF, okay? So now, what do I get? You're gonna do your B over two squared. So I'm gonna take the B value, negative three, divided by two square it, I get negative 1.5, I square, and I get, I think I get 2.25? Hold on. Oh, let me move this out of the video. Okay, so, Three divided by two gives me 1.5, and then 1.5 squared is 2.25, okay? So this is now positive 2.25. Remember, that's the square, but hold on, you guys. I'm going to change it. Okay, typically that goes inside. So because I took that B value, this is, in fact, a 2.25. However, this one, because this number is not within this factor GCF, I have to multiply them. So what's negative one times 2.25? Negative 2.25, whatever you GCF, if it's not within the parentheses, you have to multiply it. Okay, so that is now negative 2.25. So now what do I get? Well, this part stays the same. This B divided by two is the same for your complete square binomial, square. So this is still this, okay? But now you get equal. Okay, combine like terms. What is five minus 2.25? 2.75, very good. Positive, so now you move it back and I get, and so this is that vertex form. Okay, now, if you were to expand this out and add it to the negative 2.75, you're gonna get that negative five. So if I was to expand it out and clean it up, I'm gonna get that negative x squared plus three x minus five. Oh wait, I forgot my little negative one. So bring it down. I forgot my little negative one here. Put that on that negative one. Make sure you bring it down. So you only work on B and C, and then you carry the one back. Yes. And then you carry the A back. So when you have a value that is not a positive one, you can only complete the square, that B over two square, can only be used if the A value is one. So you have to divide it out or factor it out or GCF out, okay? But that constant that you take over, if it's unaffected by that factory, you have to now mess with that 2.25, multiply by that value that you removed, and then that's how you combine it with the constant. Okay, um, tomorrow I'll do number seven. And then I'll give you guys time to do eight. Okay. Can I stop recording? Yeah. 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 yeah.
Okay, um, I don't think I record very much in here, but it goes blank, but then once it loads, it'll go back to this, what you guys are looking at right now, okay? Okay.